What's up? Are we doing something here, like trying to find out how the Chinese are getting their weapons? I mean, yeah, if we could do that, that'd be great. Yeah, this guy just said his father sold guns to the Chinese. I'm gonna come speak to him. Hey, Grant, can you come over here for a sec? Yep. Alright, hang on. He's got OK guns, but he's got no uh, contraband yes. either. Okay, beautiful. Excuse me, sir, may I speak with you for a minute? Oh, yes, hold on. Give me, let me turn my radio off. Okay, <laughs> sorry. Uh, just, uh, man. This is a wonderful vehicle you have here, sir. Yeah, I like the interior work. I have very deck. much, very much money. So. This is a Jeep Wrangler from 2007, straight from Ohio. Good lord, man. Yeah, yeah, just, that's honestly yeah. impressive, sir. I know, I know. Hey, hey, like, you guys like, see you going parachuting down to our south? One second. That's my hunt IR round. All right, so sir, I one of my subordinates here told me that you have information on a arms dealer. Uh, no. What are you talking about? My father sells lots of guns, but I do not snitch on them because I'm everything gonna is legal. I'm going to be right back real quick. Oh yeah, no, I completely understand that. No good person would ever snitch on his father, even if it was for. Yes, he buys this 2007 Jeep regular for me winning my exams. Hey, good job. Yes. How'd you yes, do on them? I did great. The 10,000 uh, shekels. Or they covered it for me. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you know what they say. Uh, money can't buy you happiness, but it can get you everything else instead. And these J's on my feet. Yes. I was going to comment on those, but I... Yes, yes. Man, alive. All right. Mm -hmm. So, hang on. Like, obviously, your, your father sells weapons, but, like, you can't say, like... You know, he sells weapons. So, like, when the school administrators are getting paid all this money, like, what do you tell them he does? Oh, I just tell them that he know very much Chinese people. And then they, uh, they're like, oh, okay, okay. As your father, Bim Bargonwa, Bizamungo? And I'm like, yes, my friend, yes. Everybody know my father. Oh, uh, man. What school did you go to? What school did I go to? Yeah. Uh, I went to a private school way back then. What'd you study there? Uh, it was it was just normal school. I didn't just go to college. Uh -huh. Oh. I am taking a year to take a break and smash some bitches. Am I right, my friend? <laughs> Man, that's the way to do it. Yeah. Well, fuck, dude. No, if your dad knows a bunch of Chinese people, I mean, he could probably hook you up with some, you know, Chinese chicks. Yes, yes. I was thinking about that, but everything is knockoff, you know. He sold he sells stuff to. Chinese, and they buy it from Iranians, and then I buy American stuff with it. Dude, the American shit's the way to go. Trust me, I would know. Yes, 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 yes. Like these Jordans, yes. <laughs> shit, man. Oh, yeah. Wait, what is he buying from the Iranians? Normally you sell to them. Well, he's, he's, he's buying stuff from the Iranians, and he's doing modifications, and then selling it to the Chinese. Huh, well, you know what, honestly, the Chinese arms market is, they just got a bunch of knockoff shit and all. Yes, that's why, that's why he buys from Iranians, and Iranians buy from Russians. And Iranians buy from So. It makes no sense, like, honestly, like, what's so good about Iranian arms? Maybe I'm a little bit biased, because I'm American, but. That's the reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well. Uh. uh missile. What kind of missile? I'm sorry, I didn't, uh, it was just a joke, haha, <laughs> my friend, it was just a joke, I'm just, you're a little on edge, you know, isn't that right, my friend, <laughs> Yeah, we're all a little on edge right now. Uh, yeah. To that end, though, sir, I'm gonna have to ask you to put your hands in the air. What? We're gonna detain you here for a little bit. My father is not going to be happy about this. Well, actually, if you could, we'd love it if you could, uh, we'd love to meet your father, if at all possible. Oh my god, this is very illegal, my friend. This is, I have right. Hey, uh, I need a message up to White Collar. What do you need? I got, uh, intel on an arms dealer. I wrote down the structure of it. Like, I did too, actually. Israel, somebody buys from Israel and then sells to China. It was Iran, uh, not Israel. 
Alright, Alti, Atlas, come here. Atlas, come here. Yeah. Atlas, come here. Yeah. Alright, Bimbagon is a, is a Mungo. That guy's father is an arms dealer. Buys from Iranians, modifies it, and then sells it to the Chinese. The Russians were in there too. Hang on. How are Russians involved okay. again? The Russians are the original source. The Russians sell to the Iranians, the Iranians sell to his dad, and his dad sells to the Chinese. I know a way you could cut a few middlemen out of that, but oh well. Listen, you gotta... Right. You gotta Be advised, he also said something about a missile, but... A missile? Yeah. Do, you, do we know what kind? No, he, he shut up. He shut up real quick after that. Yeah, definitely, impound that vehicle. Let him know we have his son in captivity right now. Alright, alright. So, what was the name? Impound's on the left, right? Uh, Bimbagon is a Mongo. Ibizon is a Mongo? Yes. Yep, impound's on the left. Park it over there. Park it in there. Right, and that's... That's him, yeah? Yeah, that, no, that's his son. And he spilled all, right. all those damn beans. Because he's a fucking rich prick boy. Alright, so, so the Russians sell to Israel, Israel sell to Iran. his dad. Russians sell to Iran, not Israel, Iran. And then Iran okay, sells Iran. it to his dad, his dad sells it to the Chinese, after modifying it. Okay, uh, so wait, what was, what's his name? I'm gonna try and write this down. Alright. Bimbagon is a Mongo. I'm gonna go search him. I'm gonna go search the kid. Caller, this is Heiner Chief. Send it. Uh, we've just detained a son of a supposed arms dealer. Uh, the son of Ibagon is a Mundo. Interrogative, do we know who that is? Uh, say again his name? Ibagon is a Mundo? I'm too sure how to pronounce it. Uh, Roger, can you just spell that out for me? Let him know we got a radio from the kid, too. Yeah, sorry. Hey, we got a radio from the kid too. If you put the health, if you like check his ace Michael menu, is... it'll give, a, give you his uh, name. Oh yeah, oh, I can get a last name. Yeah, hold on, let me check. All right, keep to your sectors. Zero, how you doing over there? Which one is it? Is it the one that looks like Tor the one, the rich kid, the rich brick. Hang on, uh, we're gonna do some hearts and minds shit here. Atlas, once you get that sent out to White Collar, meet me over by one of the Vix.
Are you ready to spell it, my friend? Because it is very long. Yeah, I got my pen and paper ready. Alright, it is Mbuku. Uh, could you spell that, please? I M B U K U. Mbuku, yes. Mbuku Vahala. But V A L H A L A. Yes, Valhalla. Bizamungu. B I Z I M U N G I. Or sorry, G U. Uh, could you please spell that again? It is spelled B I Z I M U N G U, my friend. Thank you for your cooperation. Can I go home now? You actually might be able to. Uh, well, let's give us a minute here. We'll get that up to command, and hey, we'll get you back on your way to slaying some bitches. Yes, my friend. I have a new shipment uh, of I've cocaine. Got, got the name of the, yeah. of the what, bruh? Yeah. You yeah. holding out on us? His name changes yeah. every week. Roger. <laughs> All right, here. Uh, we'll just worry about the sun then. Here's. Keep him detained. Alright. Uh, Alright, well, hang on. From what I understand, it doesn't seem like you're gonna be able to head back to your house, but. Oh. Hang, hang on, hang on. Bring the house to me. Exactly! Know? Here, you tell me where the house is. I'll get some of my guys out there. We'll bring all the coke back here. How's that sound? Hey. Where is the house? I will tell you in a little bit. I just want to sit here for now. Alright. My dad is not going to be happy. Well, hey, if you know your dad is, we can go have a chit chat with him, and I can just, I can tell him it was all my fault. Like, this is, none of this was your fault, honestly. You can't get too mad at you if it's not your fault. I was just driving my Jeep. Yeah, exactly, and then some asshole stopped you. Yeah. Yeah. No, we can make this work out for you, man. Alright, I'm gonna go confer with my associates and we'll see what we can do for you, okay? Yay! Seriously, what the actual fuck? <laughs> Roger that. Uh, yeah, he's currently in PB but still. Hmm. Alright, what came with us? Uh, okay. French are gonna interrogate him. Oh, okay. Well, I'll let him know. But hang on, I got a location on a possible stash, so give me a second here. Alright, I got good news and bad news. Hey, it's my friend. Good news first. Alright, good news is you are going to be leaving here. Yay, it's my friend. Bad news is it's not on your own and it's not with us. What? Um, Some uh, are French forces are going to come by and pick you up. Oh, French forces. Can you do me a favor, yes? Oh, fuck yeah, man, what is it? Can you, uh... Can you request, uh, to have, uh... What is his name? What did father tell me? His name is, like... He's an officer, man, and his name is Petit. Uh, Petit what? Petit Dick? That's his last name, I do not... I do, I do not remember. Alright. Is he good friends with your father? Father? I, I am his firstborn son, so I inherit everything, you know? My fan is. Oh, I get you. Alright. Hey, I'll make sure I, we get that passed up to ask for him. But hey, listen, man, if you still want... I don't know when they'll be here, but if you want that coke here before they get here, because I can tell you this much, they ain't gonna let you have that shit. Well, that's okay, because uh, I'll just send it to another house, you know? Yes. 
Oh, shit. All right. Well, hey, man. It was nice talking with you. Sorry we have to leave on... Oh, yes, 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 yes. It's Lieutenant Petit. Lieutenant Petit. Yes. You, you want him to pick you up? Yes, he is a close friend with my father. He, he would treat me well, you know? Yes. All right, yeah. I'll be sure to ask for him. All right. Thank you, thank you. Grab me. I want you back at your post real quick. Hey, yo, Atlas, where is you? Say again? Where are you, man? I'm, uh, watching the game. Beautiful. I got another message for White Collar. Alright. Alright, tell him after further conversation with the dipshit of a prisoner, uh, the French officer corps has a, uh, corrupt member in the ranks, a Lieutenant uh, Petit. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, White Collar's just on the radio. Like Alright, yo, uh... The heart of the map, this little like um shack that you can't really step into it. What was this? Sorry. I found like a broken step, I guess. Where? Like you can't step it. Um, do you know that uh little shack that you said there should be like supplies in it? Yeah, this one. Yeah, this. What the fuck? All right. Well, yeah. See. Yeah, I know. Here, back up. Alright, Atlas, what's he have to say? Platinet was... Yeah, Platinet was going crazy. Alright, well, let's leave it at that, then. Um, yeah, so what do you want me to send to White Collar? Uh, tell him that, uh, the... Individual... The HVT has told us that a Lieutenant Petit would give him preferential treatment. Can I say again? Uh, inmate, uh, HVT, our prisoner, told me that, uh, to ask specifically for a Lieutenant Petit from the French forces, since he would give him special treatment. Get that officer far away from us as possible, and put him under investigation. Like, Le LT, Lieutenant User Petit. In your channel, Petit. Time down. Lieutenant the Petit. Oh, Petit. Petit, like small. Alright, I'm going to head back to our post. Yeah, exactly. Put that damn officer in investigation. I a three. Once you guys have arrived, we need a medic uh, over to our MRAP, so we have two down. There's a French detachment coming to you guys right now. Make sure Lieutenant Petit's not part of it. What the fuck? Eight zero, you up? Did zero DC? Fuck, I guess yeah, he did. He's connecting now. Well, shit, I'm a terrible fucking FTL for not noticing that. Oh fuck, I need a two IC. Cat, oh wait, no shit, medics aren't supposed to be it. Uh. Sorry, hang on. My notebook is just a mess right now. Dude, that's why I use notepad. <laughs> is Indo here? Yeah, he's uh, getting something. He's AFK. 
Uh, Alright, Grimey, I know medics aren't supposed to be two ICs, but, like, everyone else is, like, a raw dog recruit. Oh, Alright, uh, this might go bad, so don't go down. Said the French, Michael will say the French will handle it. Alright, beautiful, as long as they know about it. Alright, as soon as Zero gets back, because he's connecting now, uh, we're going to split off. We're gonna, I'm going to send a small team over there to the uh, refugee camps, uh, split, out, split out some supplies, and see if we get any more information on this particular arms dealer. But we'll wait for uh, Zero to recon reconnect. I feel like we just hit a gold mine. He didn't fucking shut up. It was beautiful. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Man, oh, why can't they all be that stupid? Yeah, make sure White Collar, uh, well, we'll tell the French when they get here, but he said, like, he was in possession of cocaine and, you know, the son of an arms dealer.